So what's the coffee today? Cold brew. Hey, it's Gail from Seattle Coffee Gear, and we thought we would compare the tastes of some different types of cold brew. This is the Hario V60, as you can see, and it was brewed over ice. This is the Osaka, and this is a slow, slow drip, and you put ice and ice up in here, and it drips, and it takes, oh, about four hours, I think it is, something like that. And then we have the OXO cold brew, which is without any ice. This is just a typical cold brew that takes about 12 to 24 hours. You, we use the same coffee, uh, mixed tape, mixed, mixed tap, mixed tap by Dogwood. Dogwood mix right there. So but I guess all that's left to do is taste it and see which one, you know, if there is a better or worse, and I doubt there is, I think there's just going to be different. But we'll see. Take this off. And then cold. This one looks uh, thinner. I'm going to start over here. This definitely looks stout. Of course, a cold brew is stout. It's typically a concentrate. Very smooth. That's yummy. Mmm. That's nice. Mmm. Even smoother, a little bit different nuances. Um, of course, this probably what I should do really is uh, dilute this down a little bit, which I could, but then I'd probably be ruining it too. And oh no, let's just give it a little squirt. There. Let's see what happens, because it's very stout. Now it's more similar. This has a little different nuances than than the OXO. Oh, this is totally different. The fragrance is different. Mm, the taste is totally different. And I don't know what to even call it. It's pulling out something that doesn't taste anything like. These two are very similar. Let me see what the nuances say. It says yummy. It doesn't really... A little... Uh, very well balanced, bassy, and a little bright. Hmm. Okay, I gotta taste this one again. Smoky. This is very smoky. That's what I'm getting out of that. It's a lighter, uh, it's not as uh, robust, but it's smoky. Totally different. Kind of like a cigarette, actually. I'm just going to keep going back and forth until I get my quota of caffeine. Yep, this one is more concentrated, but if you took and put more water with this, very similar. Very, very different, smokier. It brought out a whole different nuances and flavors out of that coffee. Try it at home yourself. See what you think. Uh, you know, every time you brew it a little bit different, it's going to taste different. If you did this with hot water, it would taste nothing like these right here. Uh, it usually brings out just a whole different flavor. Try it at home. Let us know what you think in the comments down below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks a lot for watching.